Hey, this is Will from Lifter LMS. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use the access plan checkout redirect feature to send students to a custom thank you page after they check out, or you could send them to any page you want to. So I'm in courses here on my dashboard. And if I click edit on any of my courses and then scroll down to the access plan section, this is where you'd create your access plans, maybe a monthly payment, a yearly payment, one-time payment, whatever you want to create down here. And each access plan has the feature down here for a checkout redirect. By default, it's going to return to the course so students can dive right in. But if you wanted to maybe redirect them to a custom thank you page, you could do that. You could even redirect them to a different website if you wanted to. So I'm going to say redirect to a WordPress page. And let me throw together a thank you page real quick here. So if I go to pages, add new, I'm going to put together a custom thank you page. Thank you for purchasing. And let me grab the link to my course or the name of my course here. That way, what I can do is maybe in Google Analytics, I could have a, a tracking pixel on this page. So, um, or in Facebook, I could have a tracking pixel or Google Analytics. I could do some conversion tracking based on links to tell, you know, how many uh, conversions I have based on who visits this page. And so, of course, we'd want to make sure maybe via a plugin like Yoast SEO that this page is not indexed. So the only way you could get to this page is if you just purchased. So that would be a way to set up some tracking or if you wanted to put something custom together, you could. Uh, so I'm saying thank you for purchasing. And maybe I'll say thanks for purchasing the course. Uh, visit your dashboard here. And maybe I'll put that in a button. And I'll grab a link to my dashboard page. And we can add that into the button, get a link to my dashboard. And that's what the link will be on my button right here. Perfect. So now that I have my thank you for purchasing page created in my course, let me just reload because I was, um, I created the page after I was working in the course here. So I'm going to reload on my course, go down to the access plan section, check out redirect, redirect to WordPress page after checkout. And then I'll select my thank you for purchasing page. And one note with this is this does change the purchase link. Uh, we can see the purchase link right now is uh, purchase plan 343. And so once I save my changes down here in my course, select a page, and it's going to go through its whole process of updating here. The purchase link is now going to have a redirect at the end here. And so you'll want to make sure to change the link to make sure you have the redirect in there uh, once you've updated it. So if you've put your purchase link anywhere, you'll want to make sure it has this redirect at the end because it'll change the purchase link. So now that I have my redirect on there, let's see this in action. So I will view my course and then I'll sign up as a test student here. So if a student were to come to my website, uh, click sign me up. We will fill out this information. And when I click enroll, I should now be sent to my custom thank you page here. It says I've been enrolled in the course. Thanks for purchasing the course. Visit your dashboard here. And then of course I could use this um, in Google Analytics, Facebook, whatever I wanted to do. When people hit this page, I want to make sure I note it down in my analytics software. Or if you wanted to put together a custom welcome message, you could do that. All kinds of cool things you can put together here. But that's kind of how the Lifter LMS checkout redirect works. All sorts of cool things you can put together. Let us know in the comments below what you put together on your course website with the checkout redirect page. And let us know if you have any other questions about Lifter LMS in the comments below. I'll see you in the next video.